Hey guys, it's Dina, and I am here with a Mac haul. I know that I just finished up my Sephora haul, and I know that I just posted an Alta haul, but yes, I have a Mac haul to show you guys. And let's just get started. The first thing that I have to show you guys is this Mac Fix Plus in Coconut. And this was $15. I thought it was really super cute in the store. I can travel with it and it smells fantastic. I do have the regular one in the larger size, but I thought this one was cute. And maybe I might go buy more. I'm not certain. It just kind of depends on how I feel. The second item that I have to show you guys is this MAC 224 brush. Yes, I went ahead and bought the MAC 224 brush. This is the one that people are swearing by for blending. So, I just went ahead and bought it. The next item I have is the MAC 217 brush. So, I'm excited to have those MAC brushes in my collection. The next item I have is this MAC powder in Swiss chocolate. And I tried it in the store and I really liked it. And it's like you put it on and for me to almost have nothing on my skin is awesome. But you can darken this up if you would like. Right there. And you can contour with this. I won't be doing any contouring. I don't do that. I might bronze up a little bit but contouring is not my thing. Somewhere down the line, we'll see how that works, but I'm not a contour girl. But you can use that for blush and or contour. The next blush that I have is in Raisin. And here it is here. And there it is there. That's Raisin. And then that's the Swiss Chocolate. Of course, I won't be applying them uh, this heavy. But I just wanted you to be able to see the colors, if you can see that, to see the colors on in the blush. And then I have from MAC quite a few lipsticks. I purchased Cream in Your Coffee. It's a nude color, but it's got a mauve undertone. And I thought it was really pretty when I tried it on in the store. The next item I have is Modesty. And I'm going in no particular order with these. Just taking them out and giving you a swatch. One is Modesty. And it's a neutral. And again, it's more it's a lighter color. More in the pink family. And it looks fantastic on me. Again, I tried all these in the store before I even purchased them. The next item I have is Persistence. The next color I have is Twig. Again, Twig is more in the pink family. Still a neutral, but very pretty. Next one is a satin lipstick. It's Del Rio. Very pretty colors. Again, all neutrals. Nothing that's going to be over the top for me because I'm not ready for that yet. And the last one I have is Viva Glam 3, and it is a matte lipstick. And that's Viva Glam 3. To recap the lipsticks, you've got Viva Glam 3, which is a matte lipstick. You have Del Rio, which is a satin. You have Twig, which is a satin. You have Persistence, which is a matte. You have Modesty, which is a cream sheen, and Cream in Your Coffee, and that is a cream sheen. These are all neutral colors, and they are in the mauve, pink, or just the brown family. And I really love these colors. I tried them all on in the store, and I thought they looked good on me. The last item I have is a bonus item. It is not from MAC. It's from the same department store. But it is the Bobbi Brown Highlighting Powder in Bronze Glow. And people have been talking about this. And I have been waiting for my local Sephora to have it in stock. Because they just started stocking Bobbi Brown. And they never have this. So, 
I went ahead and I bought it from the Bobby Brown counter at the department store. And there it is there. And let's just do a little swatch. I won't do a lot. And there it is. There it is. A beautiful, glowy, natural highlight color. I really like that. So I'm excited to try that. And that is all I have for you guys today. Thanks for watching my video. Please like and subscribe if you like the videos I've been posting. And I will talk to you guys later. Have a great day.